everyone in this video we are going to see the next type of your problems on trains let's see the question yeah, this is your question two trains 100 meter and 120 meter long are running in the same direction with the speeds of 72 km per hour and 54 km per hour in how much time will the first train cross the second train? So, time is equal to distance of train 1 plus distance of train 2 divided by speed of train 1, different speed of train 2 because the speed is in the same direction. If it is same direction means we should consider the difference of the speed. If it is opposite direction means we want to add both the speeds. So, what is your time here? We, we should calculate that only. What is the distance here? 100 meter plus what is the distance of second train? 120 meter by therefore time is equal to 100 plus 120 220 divided by what is the difference in the speed 12 minus 4 is 8 6 minus 5 is 18 we need to convert this 18 kilometer per hour into meter per second so 5 by 18 this 18 18 will be cancelled now 1 5 are 5 4 5 are 20 reminder 2 4 5 are 20 what is your time taken to crossing each other 44 seconds so hence your option is a here we have one different data what is the same direction same direction means we should consider the difference of, difference of their speeds let's see our next question yeah this is your next question two trains of length 140 meter and 120 meter are running in the same direction on parallel tracks with speeds 132 km per hour and 80 km per hour respectively. How much time will they take to cross each other? So time is equal to distance of train 1 plus distance of train 2 divided by speed of train different speed of 2. What is your distance first train distance 140 what is your second train distance 120 divided by what is your speed of train 1 132 difference 80 what is your second train distance speed is 80 so time is equal to 140 plus 120 260 divided by what is difference between 132 difference 80 52 52 kilometer per hour we should convert this 52 kilometer per hour into meter per second by means of multiplying with 5 by 18 so this is 9 times and this is 26 times so 26 into 5 hence 260 by 26 into 5 by 9 so here this is 1 time this is 10 times so so time is so time is equal to 10 by 5 by 9 hence 90 by 5 we can cancel it by 90 by 5 means 1 5 are 5 reminder 4 8 5 are 40 18 seconds to cross each other so your option b is correct yeah this is the example of how the train is crossing each other while means of in the same direction thank you for watching